Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Wednesday 26th of October 2022. The first trade was shared by AP. As you see, he's trading Nasdaq CFD and the macro and the structural chart, both showing uptrend. And using the trading chart of one minute, he enters here in this channel properly based on algo 1 to 5 and entry signal. Uh, when the pullback got completed and the stop loss is in the right place, now he is trailing the profits and uses active uh, management of trade to get a maximum profit out of the, this trade. And whenever it's necessary, he adds to the position and subtracts. So as the buyers push the price higher, he trails the stops. As you see, it's at break even now. And now here, adding, he's adding one position here and continuously trailing this. And the stop loss is getting tighter now to protect more profits. And again, more trailing of profits. And here he get out with maximum profit. So thank you AP for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Easy, who's trading S&P 500. This macro chart of four hours is in uptrend. As you see here, the structural chart is also in uptrend and he waited for the pullback to be completed, as you see at this point. And then the buyers came back and this switch shows that momentum is increasing. So using five minute entry chart, uh, he waits for the pullback to be completed. And then based on algo one to five, when the buyers come back, he entered here and put the stop loss here and close the profits of these three trades. Looks like three trades at this point and this point. So thank you Izzy for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Yasin who's trading uh, S&P 500 futures, here you see the breakout uh, on the macro charts and you can see it better here on 3 minute charts on the channel that it's going up and in a smaller time frames trading chart of 1 minute you can see that better with another uh, smaller entry chart that shows the pullback got completed and price got out of the range and he entered here with breakout and exit here uh, with profit based on exit strategy number one. Thank you, Yasin, for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Castro, our global instructor, trading Dow Jones Industrial Average in form of CFD. You're looking at one minute chart, and as you see, the price after reaching this level of the resistance got rejected. The sellers came back, and the momentum was increased and this area was good channel for the pullback to be completed and he entered with two positions and so far he's managing the and trailing uh, with the trailing as up and uh, locking the profit at this level and if it reached the target uh, down there in the previous support area here he can gain more profit so thanks Castro for sharing your trades with us uh, these are some of my trades at the beginning of New York market session trading S&P 500 uh, which is in kind of uptrend we had breakout here so I'm taking long position repeatedly when I see that these charts are aligned so I took all these long positions and here I saw the momentum increase so I stopped trading and then came back at the end of the session I'm waiting for the breakout here to be completed and now I'm taking long positions here repeatedly and managing the trades actively uh, with ATM and also manually so this was the channel at the end that I took. So with these trades, you see that I reached profit target of 3.5 with 82% win rate and average win to loss ratio around 0 
and the drawdown was around $300. So thanks for your attention and hope these trades are useful for you and have a wonderful day.